Today's game is being played in Newson Stadium, home of the Nashville Lycans. A lot of great music clubs in Nashville, Bricks. Yeah, I went to a country star Darth Crooks' place last night. It was like half dead. It was only 9 o'clock. It's a zombie joint, you idiot. Of course it was half dead. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The insane Colts go up against the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> the paddy wagons in the parking lots are full. The familiar scent of bodily fluids in the air. And the men's room is both flooding and on fire. And that means NFL game day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Man, last week some mutant let out a lava blast in one of the stalls in the men's room. Place went up like an oil rig. Flames and explosions. Water shooting out of where the toilets were. <laughs> I electrocuted myself using the electric hand dryer. I wish they had paper towels at least as an option. Second down and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. Nice catch, and he turns on the... Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And that'll be second down and four. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it plays on defense, schmuck. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you, and the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go. He's on And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and ten. Oh, you knew you were going to... 
to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. First down and nine. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Third down and, well, good luck. And he breaks away. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Second down and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but... I don't want to nitpick. And he was stuck to him like glue. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And it's first and ten. Oh, 
Holds him to a four yard pick up there. Second down and six. Oh, this guy just. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to eat those last two runners for this act, man. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh could it be mine? And it's first and ten. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust! In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Ben. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good! Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. But I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chip whip. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a lick and it keeps on ticking. And it's first and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well... And it's first and ten. Huh? And he made him. Oh, what the brutal hit! Well, that's a strange penalty called right there. I'm sad to notice that this ref likes talking, and it don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Oh, with a brutal hit. Second down and five. Oh. 
No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! Third down and six. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Third down and nine. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender right now. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. These aren't just regular aliens. They are criminal aliens. They have a lot of moves besides dancing. And a rat's been a chip in wallets. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And the kicker just bit the dust on that play. Someone will have to come off the bench to replace him. And it's first and ten. Berserk, the ball carrier runs away. The defense has to do a better job of watching out for that dirty trick. Oh, I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and ten. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Third down and long. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just... The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was! First down and seven. Runs it for four yards. Second down and two. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The offense is down to their 
last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. Third down and five. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. You know, before this guy was in the Mutant Football League, I believe he was in uh, the Human League. Why did he leave? Yeah, they didn't want him. Hey, man, I just can't want to chill him. I don't want to kill him. I don't sell him. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. He's a big guy smoker. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a saw block right now, this asshole. Trying to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. Any proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows... Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Monkey find his head. He'll be okay. <laughs> and completions. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive and it's first a timeout is called by the quarterback they have one left in a hurry up offense there is no huddle so neither team can put their players on the bench and with another pick is he dead uh, nah he's still moving crap I had money on him biting a big one if he don't die soon my long shot is gonna kill me And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there.
second down and two. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about that two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. He could go all the way! He's at the... And they're catching up! Joe, Joe, do something! And it's first and ten. Oh my gosh! The defensive player looks like he's lost his... And another interception! This quarterback is gonna listen to Joy... Oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched! Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? First and ten. That's a nice catch for five yards. Second down and five. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well played. Since when is that a penalty? Since now I guess, Grim. And that'll bring up second. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and two. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's all those power and green like a high cool. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. He blasts it and picks up seven yards right there. First and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Here comes the defense. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And 
It's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down and ten. Quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, man. Third down and never going to happen. And he's running like a moose. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. There's a bloody red head on the field. Now that's their red penalty marker, Briggs. Looks like this one's coming back. And it's first and ten. Ah, oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Jim, what a finish. Oh, he just got crushed. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? And it's first and ten. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. Is going to be explosive this week. He meant it literally. Third down and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. 
Nation. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my Dead Mutant bingo card. I only need one more! And it's first and ten. And that'll give him four more downs to punt. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know why. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo grip. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. First and ten. And another intercept. Oh, what a... And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. That pass was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. Second down and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how much throw intercept. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have. Oh, uh, come on. That was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Two left. They might consider running the ball more. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And he's off to the races. He's at the 30. The 20. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. 
And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. He could go all the way. He's running out of gas now. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. And he misses that extra point. Oh, well, look at clown shoes down there. Is he wearing actual clown shoes? I think so. It's probably why he missed. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. They go to a work speed dirty brick. He's so fast, he first down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore win. Second down and six. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. First down and one. They're going for two here. The offense screwed up that play, Bricks. Yeah, never had a chance, Grim. Never had a chance. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one.
And it's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First down and nine. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy. The Brits can't even get one. And he finds his target for two. right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the grounds crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can see First down and five. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. And it's first and ten. And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Ah, uh, they allowed to grab the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Second down and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. They might catch him. Oh, you fat little 
Hey man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. You gotta be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. The quarterback unleashes a spiraling pass deep down the field. Oh, the defender lays down a wicked hit and knocks the ball loose. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, jeez, here it comes. Blah. Second down and ten. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is pop the force of forfeit? That would be correct, Bricks. And here comes the extra point attempt. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. Nashville Lichens were neutered today in a devastating loss by forfeit. the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called auto-Trumpism. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every up.